Pakistan has urged India to end its illegal occupation of Okupa, Jammu and Kashmir and stop sporting terrorist activities in Pakistan. Foreign Office spokesperson Mumtaz Harablo said in a response to a question during the year-end briefing in Islamabad that Pakistan is interested in peace and negotiation and now it is the Indian authorities' request. It is their responsibility to take a responsible position for the improvement of relations between the two neighboring countries. Foreign Minister, in response to a question about Bilawal Bhutto Zardari's foreign visit, the spokesperson said that these activities shows the international community how interest is it in working with Pakistan and building consequences on various issues. Protesters have been put up in Srinagar and the other areas of India's illegally occupied Jammu and Kashmir, appealing to the United Nations to resolve the Kashmir issue as per as resolution passed on 5th January 1949. The posters were put up by pro-independent organization Jammu and Kashmir Democratic Movement and Jammu and Kashmir Political Resistance Movement. The protesters said that the Security Council has recognized the right to self-determination of Kashmiris through the resolution passed on January 5, 1949. But India is continuously refusing to give them this right, which should be noticed by the international community. The protesters have been also uploaded on other social media networking sites, including Facebook and Twitter. The poster said that it is the responsibility of the United Nations to implement its resolution to resolve the Kashmir conflict. All party Riyadh conference chairperson Musarat Alambar, Shabir Ahmed Shah, Mirwais Umar Farooq, Muhammad Yasin Malik, Mushtaqul Islam, Asya Andrabi, Dr. Hamid Fayaz, and also present in the poster. In the hilly and the plain areas of Jammu and Kashmir, illegally occupied by India, a white sheet has been spread everywhere due to the snowfall that started on Thursday. Snowfall started in almost all areas of Kashmir Valley from Thursday morning until evening. The entire valley, including Srinagar, was covered with white snow. The snowfall is the first snowfall of the season. Due to the snow, the severity of cold in the valley was slightly reduced and the long streak of dry season was also ended. Gulbarg, Pilgram, Sunamurk, Tingamurk, Kupwara, etc. in the upper parts of the valley recorded several inches of snow. Mohammad Ahsan Onto, the chairman of the International Forum for Forest Human Rights Illegally Detained in Jammu and Kashmir Illegally Occupied by India, expressed serious concern over the growing atrocities of Narendra Modi's fascist Indian government on freedom-loving Kashmiris. Mohammad Ahsan Onto said in a message from Court Balawal Jail in Jammu region that the occupying Indian forces killed innocent Kashmiri youth in fake encounter, while the notorious Indian investigative agencies accelerated the process of confiscated the property of people associated with the freedom movement. It's given, he said that, all false cases are being responded against freedom activists to make them target to revenge. Mohammed Esaranto said that the present hundred of Kashmiri's youth are locked up in the Indian jail. Kashmiri prisoners are being transferred from the jail from the occupied area of the distant Indian that's all for now. Keep watching this TV USA. Log into your website, thisTVUSA.com.